name is Tiffany Player, and I'm a graduate student in the Department of History at Washington University in St. Louis. And I am going into my fifth year of a PhD study. And I am researching and writing a dissertation entitled Black Women and the Politics of Slavery from the Antebellum Era Through the Great Depression. What particularly brought me here to Philadelphia um, and to the Historical Society of Pennsylvania is um, one of my chapters focuses on the centennial anniversary of the Pennsylvania Abolition Society that featured um, a black female uh, abolitionist, Frances Ellen Watkins Harper. Um, she was a featured speaker at the centennial, um, and I'm interested in how um, she used that opportunity to kind of set an agenda for um, post-emancipation black political culture. But she started her anti-slavery work in the 1850s, and she uh, did the abolitionist circuit. Um, she spoke all across um, the Midwest and the Northeast, um, kind of trying to um, raise funds for um, fugitive slaves, raise funds for um, anti-slavery magazines like The Liberator, um, and the National Anti-Slavery Standard. Um, but she was also a part of a vibrant um, black women's network um, in, uh, in Philadelphia because it had um, the largest free black population um, in the United States. She was just a part of this um, community that uh, an institutional culture made up of schools and churches and associations. And so she was really, um, kind of a foremother um, of black female abolitionists and then later generations of African Americans who were involved in the black women's club movement in the 1890s and early 20th century. So she's a key figure um, who kind of connected the dots um, in black women's history um, in the 19th and 20th century. And so the PAS Centennial is um, a it's first and foremost a commemorative event, um, but it's also um, kind of shows um, the, a moment of identity crisis for abolitionists after the Civil War to kind of figure out what the next step was um, in post-emancipation politics. There is a pamphlet um, that contains all of the speeches that are, were um, presented before the centennial um, anniversary. The particular section that I started with was um, the speech that Frances Ellen Watkins Harper um, gave, in which she um, says, quote, she's uh, interested in mingling complaint in a season of general rejoicing. So she is interested in kind of also bringing up the continued problems that African Americans are facing in the South, even as abolitionists are kind of applauding um, the culmination of their um, of their anti-slavery efforts. And so I was interested in the way that she is kind of using this occasion to talk about what still needs to be done and kind of trying to shape not only the agenda of the PAS, but um, kind of trying to encourage abolitionists to make the transition to civil rights, civil rights agenda. So this pamphlet has not only her speech, but the speech of um, Frederick Douglass. Um,